What's going on? Get back. If you're returning to the page, thank you. If you're new to the page, welcome. So this video is not gonna be as entertaining as the beginning part of this video, but it is gonna give, it, give you kind of an insight. Jesus, why can't I fucking talk today? I didn't have my ginkgo biloba. Take your ginkgo biloba. Oh, but you know what I learned today? A chef's hat has a hundred pleats and it's meant to represent the amount of different ways that you can make an egg. Pointless, useless information that I carry in this noggin. But uh, yeah, there's nothing to this video. Maybe a little bit of banter between my good buddy Rocky, who got me this job, shout out. And uh, the motor hand helping us unload the uh, hanger so we can hook it up because I couldn't do it the first time. There's video that I need to upload because it's pretty much 30 minutes of me struggling, probably 30 minutes or more of me struggling to put a hanger on because I, I, I didn't, didn't know how to troubleshoot my problem and Rocky fixed it in less than five minutes. Anyway, enjoy. I got a GoPro mount for my GoPro, for my hard hat. So now I'm the nerd with the GoPro. So you see me on the drilling rig. Say hi. Might make it on my channel that nobody watches yet, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Later. What's up, everybody? So we're back at the old 593. In the distance, you'll see the casing crews trucks, and that's all their equipment. That's what they use to put casing into the well and right here you'll see the driller shack and right, that's where the driller sits nothing too crazy going on in here this is the rig floor that tool that's on the tugger i'm not 100 percent sure what that's used for in fact i'm not sure what it's used for at all i know it's a weatherford tool i don't know what they do with that tool maybe i should know no i don't think it doesn't concern me i mean at least i don't think it concerns me but the casing crew's right there, just waiting for them to get their tools out of the way so I can land the hangar. And right here, just uh, shooting the shit. What's up, brother? You're big fucking strong, man. What's that? You said you need the loader, you said fuck no. Oh, I wanted, I wanted the loader, but he lifts, I don't lift. and Luke it? No. Huh? No. I'll stop it. You better not <laughs> put it up there and then you just fucking drop it. Lubricate or no? Level. How do you open it without picking that fucking thing up? Because this is brand new. Squeeze. Oh, fuck off. No. Your feet days done. Oh, that's right. I know, I wasn't, I wasn't a So what my boy Rocky yeah, here is about to show you is how yeah, easy this route comes <laughs> after doing it as long as he's been doing it. So, like I said, there's seals inside the landing joint, which is what the hangar is going into. And he got it in like nothing. And then he's gonna give me a cocky little smile. Good at that. Motherfucker. And all, uh, just, um, there's rage in my head and, and I'm just, embarrassed but fuck this job <laughs> sometimes it's like that sometimes you know you're working with a co-worker and it makes life a little bit easier so you know it is what it is this is our shop there's nothing to it this is just where we come unload load tools clean tools get job boxes ready whatever we need our shop hands kind of help us out and then also we got a guy that actually runs the, the whole warehouse as far as inventory and then out that door, 
that you're looking at right there. And the other door is more yard. So more parts, more tools, trucks, whatever. Whatever we need, it's, it's all out that way. There's shops that are way bigger than this. So this is a little one. Like I said, I think I said, uh, stay tuned after the video. This is kind of the lay of the land. This is on our on my way back from the rig job. I mean, this is just awesome scenery, at least in my opinion. And got all these wild horses running around. Again, this is federal land, so that's why they're, they just roam around. I don't know if they actually belong to someone or if they are, in fact, someone's horses. Go, Who knows? I just thought... They're beautiful animals, and I was going to honk, but I, I didn't want to scare them. At least the horses were cool, right? Because that video was absolute and utter dog shit. And I apologize. Here I was, ranting and raving about this GoPro mount that I got from my fucking hard hat. Yeah, I'm going to fucking wear it on the jobs. And yeah, that, 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 that. Sorry. It is what it is. I showed you what I showed you. The angle was terrible. No point in the video at all. But it is what it is. And honestly, it's a lot better than Biden sending 500 million fucking dollars of your well-earned money to the Ukraine. Thanks for nothing, Joe. Appreciate it. 2024 is around the corner. Do the right thing. But I digress. Look, like, comment, subscribe. God bless you. God bless America. God bless the oil field. God bless fucking horses. And God bless the fucking airborne. And you know what? God bless America again and again and again. <sighs> like, comment, subscribe again. Please. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.